Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. You have but one Father in heaven. You have but one Master, the Christ. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, Lord. Jesus spoke to his disciples, do not, do not be called rabbi. You have but one teacher, and you are all brothers. Call no one on earth your father. You have but one father in heaven. Do not be called master. You have but one master, the Christ. The greatest among you must be your servant. Whoever exalts himself will be humbled, but whoever humbles himself will be exalted. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Well, as we celebrate the Feast of St. Augustine today, uh, fourth century bishop and doctor of the church, uh, it, it really is a uh, quite a moment for us to reflect on the last part of this gospel. Whoever exalts himself will be humbled, but whoever humbles himself will be exalted. Um, you know, part of the struggle that uh, uh, St. Augustine had in his life was that uh, there was a, uh, the, the, it was really a, 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 the spirit of conversion that he was fighting his whole life uh, and actually up until the point when he uh, really chose to be baptized and uh, uh, he had lived quite a, a desol dissolute life uh, a sinful life if you will up until that point so he was 32 uh, when he really converted to become a Roman Catholic Christian and of course it was due to the prayers of his mother Saint Monica who had prayed all those years for him to be converted uh, but part I think what's happening for him is that he was able to face what he needed to do before God humbly face the conversion that he needed to accept in his life humbly and allow Jesus to enter his life in that personal way to help him with what he was struggling with in his life and what was keeping him from really giving his life to Christ and, and we know that it was an experience with scripture eventually and it was an experience in which he heard a child which he believes was a child Jesus say take and read take and read which is take and read the scriptures uh, and when he opened the scriptures all of a sudden it exploded for him and uh, he was filled with uh, the love of God and, and thus enabled to be converted completely in his life. Um, and he has become, of course, uh, one of the great uh, saints, one of the doctors of the church. Uh, and so the example is for us, too, uh, to humbly stand before the Lord Jesus in the way we need to be converted let him really touch our lives fully. Let him help us become a saint in his name.